This to me seems like a much, much better, more powerful, more integrated version of what the plugins was that they announced a couple years ago that never really caught on. If we take a peek over at the press release on the OpenAI website where they introduced these new features, we can see the tools that they have built in by default from the beginning. We've got booking.com, so you can actually book hotel rooms straight from ChatGPT. You've got Canva, where it can generate images directly inside of ChatGPT, Coursera, Expedia, Figma, Spotify, which we just demoed, and Zillow. And then here's some of the apps that are coming soon that you'll be able to basically chat, interact with directly from within ChatGPT. All Trails, DoorDash, Khan Academy, Instacart, Peloton, OpenTable, Target, The Fork, TripAdvisor, Thumbtack, and Uber, and even more coming soon. In fact, ChatGPT has an SDK or software development kit, which is designed to help people develop apps that will work inside of ChatGPT. This to me seems like a much, much better, more powerful, more integrated version of what the plugins was that they announced a couple years ago that never really caught on. But I think that was because you had to go and make extra connections to these plugins and it was kind of a pain in the butt. Now you just talk to the tool you wanna use and it will just try to access that tool. Much lower barrier for anybody to actually use these tools.